sweet bumblebees. I'm Gigi Ma Mel, and this is Living It Gigi Ma Style. I'm sitting at my um, kitchen counter. It's 8.36 or something like that this morning. Um, and today I'm going to do a little work in progress on a doll that I am, a blind doll that I am all going to offer in my new Etsy store. I showed her a little bit yesterday, but I have done a little bit more work on her. Let me show you what we have so far. All right, let me untangle everything here. There she is. Look at her. Isn't she beautiful? Let's see if I can get a little closer up. I've been doing some touch-up painting on her base layers with her knees and everything. There's her face. We're going to put some um, teal. I've decided to name her um, Violet Teal. We're going to put some little um, teal eyebrows on her. And then we're going to put some little white details on her in a few places. And then I need to string her string or bead her strings and do something with her hair. And um, I have a little dress that I'm going to make for her. And that will be a different video. Um, I'm going to put that together with you guys. And then she will be available on my Etsy, new Etsy store, Timel Creations. What do you think of her so far? Isn't she beautiful? I um, also have another doll coming. And I think she's going to look really cool. I'm going to call her Snow. And she's got white hair. And I'm going to paint her to look like a snowstorm. You guys, um, and then she will be available in December, I think. It's going to be a while before she gets here. So, well, we're here. I'm going to go ahead and get her eyebrows painted on. And we'll start on the little um, details for her. Little white, I'm just going to do little white dot details. I thought that would look really pretty on the tail in the purple. Alright, let's go ahead and see about, not move her around too much. Yeah, just trying to um, eye where to put them. And if you guys have been with me for a little while, one of the characters in my Blythe, Blythington Academy has little leaves branches for eyebrows and that's kind of what I'm going to do for this one today yeah I think that'll be really pretty Oops, Midgey's making noise. Oh, yeah, that is nice. I like it. Turn her head just a little bit so I can see this one side. I don't stick my tongue out, but I do have my mouth open most of the time when I'm working. <clears throat> And I just fibbed on myself, didn't I? I stuck my tongue out. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, there's one. Get the other side and I'll show you. Hey, puppy dog hair in my coffee. It looks, guys, like I need to redo my hair. It's dark on top. It's starting to look like fire a little bit. It's getting really orange on the bottom. Okay. Turn her little pussy this way. And then she'll get a couple of good coats of... Um, matte clear matte varnish and put my coffee back there so I can see what I'm doing here and uh let dry for a couple of days before I do anything else to her because I want to make sure that her paint stays as long as possible I will do a little bit of a disclaimer here, guys. Just a little bit. Um, painting these dolls like this, unfortunately, the paint um, on... where the... Um, joints are sometimes does not I'm being yelled at I'll be right back hi hey guys I'm back it took me a little while um my midgy widgy my little chihuahua wanted some lovins so she got some lovins and then I went to get the beads to put beads on little um velvet teal strings and my bead containers bottom fell out thank goodness i didn't pick it up all the way <laughs> yesterday i bought or yeah i think it was yesterday or the day before um i bought a container Oh, hang on just a sec. Sorry about that. I bought this. And it had all kinds of beads in it. Right? And it wasn't broken when I bought it. But when I went to pick it up this morning, there's a big old hole in the bottom of it. I don't know if you can see that, but look. Um, thank goodness I didn't pick it up all the way off the table. Only a few beads fell out. So I had to run to the store and get a container to put the beads in. And I went ahead and finished up her painting and got her uh, sealed. And this is, this is what she turned out to look like. Now, I am going to... Um, do something with her hair but isn't she gorgeous let me open her eyes i have a dress that i'm going to make for her as i said that will be a separate video and then this young lady will be um there's her eyes Um, will be for sale on my Etsy channel or Etsy store and I am going to do something with her hair I have an idea I just got to do it all right what do you think isn't she gorgeous let me see if I can get a close-up of her face for you um see how I did the eyebrows yeah, she is just gorgeous. And she will be listed on uh, my Etsy store, Tamel Creations, in the next couple of days, okay? I hope you enjoyed watching my little video here today. If you did, please 
think hit the like button and if you like me hit the subscribe button and leave me a comment would you let me know what you think of violet teal all right guys from Gigi and violet be happy be safe be sensible and do your very very best to behave i love you guys and i will see you again very soon bye